But with vaccine appointments quickly filling up, some people are traveling to other regions to get their shots, and many believe it's not a bad idea to get more people vaccinated. Manisa Danabalan has the latest. I'm from Vineland. Traveling to Hamilton to get a vaccine, a Niagara resident booked his appointment at the Wellington Clinic because there weren't any spots available in Niagara. Also, it was the AstraZeneca, and I was preferring to get the Pfizer. I think it's just important that everybody gets it whenever they, as soon as they can. Niagara Public Health says their vaccination clinics were fully booked through April 18, making residents look to other areas. At the end of the day, if there's empty spots that one could take over another, then so be it. Dr. Zane Chagla says the less people are in hospitals across the province, the better. So traveling to get a vaccine during a stay-at-home order should be fine. Medical appointments are a part of exemption from the stay-at-home order. You know, being a doctor in Hamilton, I know that I see patients regularly from Niagara. I see patients regularly from Brand, from Halton, as we're a referral center for many other centers. So, you know, again, it's it's not the, the end of the world if they travel directly for the vaccine appointment and come back after that. Both Hamilton and Niagara Public Health say the province's online booking tool lets eligible Ontarians book an appointment at any clinic in the province. Mayor Jim Diodati says he's aware of people from Niagara Falls going to Toronto for their shopping. I think it's fairly done, but for some reason there's not as much uptake in certain areas. So the main thing is don't waste any vaccine spots, fill them up, start with your backyard. If that doesn't work, bring people in from other backyards. And it, it cuts both ways. So Hamiltonians are actually eligible to uh, to book vaccine, vaccine appointments uh, in, in any other community in the province of Ontario that's currently offering vaccinations. So, uh, you know what, I think it cuts both ways and it's probably, uh, it evens out at the end of the day. But NDP leader Andrea Horvath blames the Ford government for not distributing vaccines properly and sending mixed messages about region hopping. To this day, there are thousands, hundreds of thousands of vaccines that remain uh, unutilized. They could be in the Niagara region right now. And many people we spoke to at the Wellington Vaccine Clinic say they don't mind people coming from other regions. Well, I'm sure there were people from Hamilton going to Toronto because you could book it online. That's going to have the population, that's going to have the community too. You got it make yourself safe, not only for yourself, but for other people too. Niagara Health says there are appointments available for the end of April and early May at their clinic in St. Catharines. And more appointments are being added at public health clinics in West Lincoln and Port Colborne from April 19th to the 30th.